Hi, everyone. Welcome back. I'm Professor Hall, and this is week 11 of English 240, Literature and Identity, and we are in our third week of talking about the book Pachinko. Again, make sure that you plan your reading time. It's, it's, it is quite a long book, and there's still a bit to get through in this third section. I don't have a lecture video for you today, because this week, because I have an interview from the author. Um, and I hope that you learn a lot from her. I think she has some interesting things to say about what she intended with this book and why she wrote it and all of that kind of thing. We're also going to have another discussion um, because I think there's a lot to talk about with this book. And I thought that if I just had a journal, you wouldn't really be able to kind of explore everything and, and talk about it with your peers. So I hope that you do that. And um, going into the next module where we're going to really be looking at a totally different experience. Um, so I know that the end of this book a lot of darker things happen here and it isn't um, always pleasant for these characters. But we've talked about by this point how that's kind of a theme in the book. Um, the game of pachinko is a game of chance and sometimes fate rules people's lives. So you're going to really see uh, how all of their experiences so far drive forward um, the endings for them. And hopefully by the end, it's it's kind of a little bit bittersweet. Uh, it's not exactly like a sad, tragic ending, but it's not exactly a happy ending either. And I do think that that is also kind of realistic to life. So I'm really interested to see in your discussion what you've learned so far, um, what you got out of this book, and uh, what you saw in terms of the different identities of the characters and, and all of that kind of thing. So um, that's it. If you have any questions this week, just let me know. Thanks.